hundreds of people joining Norman High School students in a walkout over rape allegations. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Jessica Shamba. And I'm Paul Folger. The district is facing that backlash because some are upset with how those allegations have been handled. KOCO's Bree Stephan is live in Norman with what these crowds hope to accomplish. Bree? Well, Paul and Jessica, the protest is wrapping up, but earlier today, almost a thousand people lined these streets. And at 9:20 this morning, students here at Norman High School walked out of their classrooms to show that they will not stand by while rape and bullying get swept under the rug. One by one, they walked out. Hundreds united by the same purpose. One of the administrators suspended a girl simply because she was on the drugs used to rape her. We will not stand for that any longer. If girls are getting mocked out of their school for being raped, obviously it's happening. Harsh accusations against Norman High. What do we want? Justice! When do we want it? Students protesting how administration handled multiple rape accusations and victims who say they were bullied out of school. No more bullying! Officials say they handled all three accusations appropriately, even suspending the student who was accused. Since mid-September when we were aware of the very first report, we believe that we've acted quickly and uh, as within the bounds of law um, and, and sensitively. There is unfortunately some mis misinformation out there about what we've done. Now many hope this demonstration starts a renaissance within the school that starts from the top down. There's no way that this can be forgotten. There has nothing like this at Norman High that has ever happened before. And Norman police released a statement today saying that Norman Public Schools have, has cooperated fully with their investigation and hasn't held anything back. Now, in addition to this protest, students also gave the school a list of changes they want to see here. In Norman, Bree Steffen, KOCO 5 News. And now we have the breakdown of numbers. The district tells us that 273 students had their parents' permission to protest today. 639 kids were not in the classroom for the first hour this morning. Actually, somewhat decent number because Norman High's enrollment is over 1,900.